Baston Villa defender Courtney Hawes reveals horrifying ordeal as five thugs tried to kidnap him on Boxing Day 2018. Aston Villa defender Courtney Hawes has opened up about the time five thugs tried to kidnap him on Boxing Day 2018. The then Wolves defender wasn't named in Nuno Espirito Santo's squad to face Fulham, so he decided to travel down to Essex to visit friends and family. Hawes went to Oxford Circus the next day with a friend to do some shopping, but was followed home by thugs for 40 minutes. The 26-year-old admitted he thought it was a prank in the second part of a documentary titled Powerhouse Journey Feet. Courtney. He detailed, I've walked to my front door, my boy has pulled off in a car, all tinted, pulled up and then stopped. All the doors opened apart from the driver's door, and like five guys hopped out of the car, and I'm thinking what's this some prank? I remember there was a tall guy, and the other guys were like average height, but the tall guy was like grab him, grab him, grab him. Big man Hawes put up a fight and managed to dash one of his attackers before he was hit with what he believes was a bottle. Hawes was left with a nasty cut on the side of the head. He continued, he pulls his arm back, I think he is going to punch me, but that's when he like, it must have been a bottle because it smashed, it must have been the end of a bottle, and that is where I got that scar. I got that scar from him literally whacking my head with a bottle. The villa defender managed to momentarily escape his attackers and made a run for it down the road, but didn't knock at the neighbor's house out of fear of how they would react to the situation. Hawes said, I don't know what to do. Do I knock on the door and try to ask for help? But I'm thinking, black man, do you know what I mean? 6FT2 with blood down his head, blood running down his face. They'd think it was gang-related or something. No one's going to help me. Instead, Hawes decided to run to the nearby hospital, but was caught up by his attackers in a car just as he reached his destination. Hawes at this point was fearing for his life, scared a gun may be pulled on him. He continued, I can't even see through the window, it's like a nightmare you know when you can't even see the person's face, it's like a blur. It's just black isn't it? I'm thinking who is this, no word of a lie, I know it sounds mad, but I thought the window was going to come down, and I thought they were going to shoot me. I thought they were going to have a gun and shoot me. I was thinking why are you chasing me this much? You must